All right, gang, how much have we made from the metaverse so far? The company's actually lost $17 billion since pivoting to the metaverse, sir. Damn. Oh, well, you win some, you lose some, I guess. I'm sure that our data mining is more than making up for that. Actually, we've already sold all of our user data to government agencies. So until we find a way of mining more, I'm afraid we'll be operating at a loss mark. Please call me Mr. Zuckerberg. All right, well, we're just going to have to start thinking outside the box here, people. Any ideas? Well, we could listen to the market feedback and stop throwing money at the metaverse. Any other ideas? We could sell Instagram to free up some market capital. It could have the extra benefit of reintroducing some healthy competition into the market. And give up our monopoly on shallow, photocentric vanity apps? Are you crazy? Tell whoever hired you to fire you. All right, well, we seem to be all out of good ideas. So we'll just go for plan B again. Ripping off somebody else's good idea. What did you have in mind, sir? Are any of you familiar with Twitter? Uh, yes, sir. We, uh, we know what Twitter is. Good. So here's what I'm thinking. We remake Twitter. Like, straight up just copy and paste the thing. Like, don't get me wrong, we'll add a few extra features here and there, like incessant fact-checking and totalitarian levels of censorship. But other than that, it's just a straight-up clone copy. But Mark, isn't it unethical to steal someone else's business idea like this? Yeah, that's an interesting point, Sanjay. But fact-checkers added the context that I just fired you about 20 seconds ago, so your opinion's invalid. Well, technically, you didn't actually fire me, Mark. You just told me to tell the person who hired me to fire me. And Sanjay, seriously, dude, get the fuck out of my office. Okay. But Sanjay does have a point, sir. Isn't there a chance that we could get sued for infringing on intellectual property rights? Look, if I was afraid of intellectual property law, I wouldn't have stole stories from Snapchat and reels from TikTok. The truth is that any legal case brought against me is doomed to fail. How so? You see, the legal system is designed to deal with human legal matters. Being a lizard creature offers me a unique legal loophole where I can, in effect, operate outside the law. Think about it like this. It's like I'm constantly in international waters. I, uh, I see. And besides, I'm sure that Elon will just take it as a compliment. Imitation is the sincerest form of flattery and all of that shit. And, you know, if he does take it badly, it'll mean he'll be overly emotional going into our upcoming fight to the death. Fight to the death? Sir, isn't that just a charity fight? That's what he thinks. 